Hello guys, it's been a long time since I made uh, an update in this tank. Tank's doing well enough, can't complain. Today I'm going to uh, retrofit these Chinese black boxes with some T5 tubes. So I'm going to put a T5 tube on either side of this LEDs. So I said I saw the BRS video about mixing LEDs and T5s, so I said I'd give it a go. So uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. <coughs> now I have the black boxes taken down. You can see what time they are. They're uh, I don't know if there's a brand name, but they're the timer and dimmer black boxes. Usually they're all kind of the same. Full spectrum. So they're down now. Now I'm gonna take them apart, clean them, put the lenses back in because a while ago I took the lenses out to give a bit more spread. But now because of the T5 lights, I'm gonna have to actually hang it a bit higher. So I want the lenses back in so I don't get as much shine into the room, which is kind of annoying. So yep. Here's the black box opened up. Here's the circuit or the LED board without any lenses. As you can see, I have one, two LEDs that have been fried. I never noticed before, never really looked, I guess. So I guess it's a good job that I'm uh, supplementing the T5s. So now you see I have the lenses back on, except for the two obviously that burnt out. I also drilled two small holes here on this fixture so I clipped the T5 fixture into onto the bottom of the LEDs now with these <laughs> for some reason this uh, <coughs> this brand of black box doesn't allow you to clip the lenses onto the LED so I had to try and use a little bit of super glue there to hold them in place because they're just resting on top of the LED I'm afraid as soon as I try to uh, put them back in, they'll all fall apart. So this part could be tricky. Okay, let's see how it goes. Now well, the lights are hanging back up. I have the lenses back in, as you can see. If you can't see, 90 degree lenses. And here you see, this is where I modded the black box. These little uh, clips that will hold the T5 fixtures. One on that side, one on that side, one on this side, one on this side. So the T5 will clip all the way along. And now the T5 is up and running. As you can see there, working okay, doing the job. Everything's very blue of course. KZ super blue bulbs. Obviously I need reflectors because I'm getting blinded by these, but the reflectors are on the way somewhere but yeah looks nice nice color from the bulbs extremely blue of course but I'm obviously going to use my LEDs too let's turn them on now and see what it looks like now that is a bright tank the lens is back in and everything, so I'm gonna obviously have to adjust it here. I'm gonna turn my blues way down and leave the whites at around 50%. And that should be good to go then. Doesn't look the best, a few more adjustments to be done, I guess. A bit of fixing up, a bit of tidying up. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. It was pretty easy, a bit of painless to attach the T5 to the bottom of the black box. If you can see along there, not much. I think a few of the outside LEDs are hitting the T5, but not too bad. Still getting good spread in the tank. So, yeah, happy days. 
So here it is all finished. LEDs and T5s are on. Tank's a little bit darker than it usually is because it's the LEDs are ramping down now, it's evening time. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. I'll make a tank update again soon as soon as I get a chance. Here's my ghetto reflector. A bit of aluminium foil or tin foil just to keep the light from bouncing into the room. I couldn't look at the tank because there was too much light in my eyes. So this will do until the reflectors are coming on. Pretty ghetto. So yeah. That's it. That will work now for a while. Hopefully the guy in the LFS will have the reflectors soon. Alright, thank you guys.